God bless you. God bless you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. To our lords, to him all the praise. To him all the glory. Let its teaching benefit you and bring you closer to our lords. And uh, that's my prayer and invite the Lord for yourself by listening one day to this teaching and the Lord is with you. He's listening and he's aware about your thoughts, about your willingness and uh, give him praise, give him praise, give him praise so you open your heart for him and you can receive. Right very uh the lord give me this uh, teaching very in um important and um it speaks about we can the the john the bible teaches in john uh, we are friends of god if we do what he wants uh, if we obey jesus but i want to bring an, an other level what the lord give me to deliver to um and I want to read this so this make it very clear. And the Lord gave me this that we, um, the Lord is a Father. Uh, the Father is uh, is is God. Is is it is not. I cannot describe Him, and there is not enough lang language for me enough to. Uh, to describe and uh, most of the time the expressi uh, the expression what he gave in singing or in praying is uh, there is no words and uh, it's too special and uh, but the father uh, have a feeling uh, he have um, an he needs something also for you and not only that you obey him not only that you love him had uh, by love he will manifest himself say Jesus I will manifest myself by your love that you keep my commandments and ha that you have my word that I speak to you that you have my word that I speak to you but also um, the father uh, give me this teaching that you are wise and uh, that you are wise in your heart and that means this that you are wise in your thinking in your feelings Jesus is located <laughs> and dwelling in your heart and uh, I <laughs> it's it's for me I'm <laughs> it's too special I don't know I cannot su subscribe it I'm not so far. <laughs> oh, jeez. Let me read this scripture. So, um, let me read this scripture. And uh, it's Galatians. And it's, it's too special. Um, and I, my, my, my prayer for myself is that I, get more more and more connected but with only that this idea I know he is there I feel him is his presence is more real than the people around me and years ago Benny him te teaches and this so true uh, and uh, I bless him Benny him is he's, uh, he's amazing I bless his ministry but I bless his his woman his, uh, his children right and because ye are sons eh, God had sent forth the spirit of his son into your heart and you know this that you no longer feel and knowing yes the devil comes but there is no more condemnation in your heart there's a change in your heart and crying Abba Abba the, you, the spirit of God will, will cry out to the father he helps you Think about this. Only this is all enough for this teaching. 
I want to go to Proverbs 27, verse 11, and think about what I share with you, please. My son, be wise and make my heart glad. It gives God and gladness and joy if you are wise, that I may answer him that reproach me. Think about this. Think about this. Be wise and think about this. This is God loves you. But there is an accuser that comes to God and points something out that God allow in your life. God allow a certain thoughts speaking from you. And maybe you're not aware of it, but the Lord will show you now. That's my prayer. <laughs> That's my prayer to help you. So you can change this. You can change this. And I know this for myself. It is, oh, you need the Lord. I need the Lord too. I need the Lord Jesus. And he's so patient. And also, it's an honor for God to, to hide certain things for you. If you don't know this, uh, many times the Lord gave me this scripture in mind, in thoughts, in prayer, in singing, or, or in my walk daily, I was busy. And then God will some, show you something, and it is about me. It was an invitation. It's too special. If you know this, it's too special. It's too special how... Um, and men are in the same way designed. If a woman don't draw something like to draw from her man in a certain way, and a woman also, the the <laughs> women are special, <laughs> a special desire by God. Let me read, and let me read, of course, the King James. Right. It's the glory of God that conceals all things. Oh, there's a very odd other translation. Let me re read the translation from the Dutch. <laughs> it is for God. Yes, it's the same. Yes, I understand. Right. Right, it's very beautiful. It's a glory for God, it's an honor of God to conceal a thing, but the horn of the king is search out the matter. It is the glory of God to, to conceal and think. Think about this. Think about this. Think about this. But listen, if you are, the, the Bible teaches this with this uh, scripture. Be wise, my son. Be wise, be wise, be wise. So, if the accuser comes, the devil, what he comes to do is to point something out in your life. So, what is happening by Job? The devil comes to God and the devil finds nothing. And if you are not wise, you speak some, some strange things. And if the devil comes, God already forgive you, but there is legal ground. You give the devil legal ground. Think about this. My son be wise and make my heart glad that I may answer him that reproach me. Reproach me. My son is a passion to say, my son, when you walk in wisdom, my heart is filled with gladness. For your 
for the way your life is improved that I am not taught you in vain. There's another translation, but I want to use wise, that you are wise. So can God give the devil an answer for you? Right, I want to round up with this. I want, let me, <laughs> I want to give you more foundation. Your hard thoughts are the reason that you are judged. But let me let me read an, an other uh, other uh, scripture. Let David say, "Let the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart be acceptable in thy sight." In thy sight, O oh Lord, my strength and my redeemer. And let the words of my mouth, my speaking. And the meditation, what I what I, I think in my heart, be acceptable in the sight. Not perfect. There listen, you are not perfect. There you can you are human. We have to be we have to exercise ourselves in a way that we are be wise in our thinking. So if we, we discern something in our thinking we, we separate this from our thinking. There's also a renewing of our mind. But we honor by this lifestyle, honor we, we cut. Paul said this in this way, it's very beautiful, and then I want to round up. And herein do I exercise myself to have always a conscience void of offense toward God and toward man. And other translation this that I'm always have an and um, a conscience without even no annoyance inside. No offense to God. No offense to God, and to men, toward men. That give you, if you, if you, if you exercise yourself therein, you are wise, wise, and you give no space. This beautiful. I want to round it up with the last scripture. So <laughs> it is too beautiful. It's 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 a real blessing. And that's the key. Submit yourself therefore to God. Be wise for God. Resist the devil and he will flee from you. There is no place you give your devil no place in your thinking, in your speaking, in your feelings. James 4 verse 7. Right, please share, share, share this message so many times and like my channel that the Lord will give you understanding and bless you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ and thank you for listening.